home farm ideas and today I'm showing you how to build a cricket trap. You basically just take a little water bottle, cut the top off. I know, rocket science already, huh? And then uh, you want to make sure that you put some rotting vegetation in it. Um, I got strawberries in here and uh, you want to make sure that you're cutting them in half. <clears throat> Try to get ones that are kind of going rotten or have already been eaten off of. See that? Um, once this stuff starts going rotten or over ripening, um, the uh, crickets will definitely eat them. They love rotting vegetation. Vegetation. So I'm gonna put a bunch of stuff in there for them, right? So there we go. We got a bunch of bait, basically. And then we take that, we put it all the way down, and then we want to build like a little ramp for them to get in. So we build up uh, grass and stuff around it, right? And that's it. We basically wait and see what happens. Um, so let's check it out. Let's see what happens. You also want to put uh, little pieces of cardboard and stuff in there so that uh, they don't get scared off and try to jump out. They'll actually hide under it. Um, don't build it up too high though because you don't want them jumping on the top of it and trying to get out. You kind of just want to make sure that it's at the bottom there. Let's lean in for a look. Okay. So there you go. So here we are the next day and let's check the trap. Let's see. I don't see anything right off the bat. Um, I can see little bugs in there. Let's see what I got here. Oh, got an earwig. Oh, got a couple of them in there. I don't know how many's in there, but um, those. You can take those out of the garden too. I mean, uh, take those out and feed those to the chickens. They love them. But we were looking for crickets. Um, so maybe they're not coming up in the planter as much as I had hoped. Um, that way we can try to catch them over here. So maybe we need to place them in a different spot, um, like over on the boards. Uh, uh, which we could just kind of modify it then. We can just put this like that. Uh, that way we can lay this on the ground and uh, take the cap off and have them crawl up in there, but they won't be able to get out. All right, so let's try that. Let's place that over where the crickets actually are. This is where they always are, so let's just move this. I'm not going to try to grab them or anything right now, but let's just see if any come out. <laughs> see all them? All right, so be pointless just to try to catch them like that. So what I did was... I modified this a little. I just basically cut a little slit in the plastic here. That way this can fit in there kind of snug. And then uh, I'm going to set it down just like this. Put this board back over there. All right? Give the give them a little place to hide. And then on the inside of that, I'm going to place this little piece of wood for something for them to basically crawl on. That way they don't slip on that plastic. Tonight, they'll be coming out all over here. And uh, put that little stick there to where they can crawl up on that and jump right in through that hole there. Okay. And once they get in, they try to come back out and they can't come out. And then I'll have a bunch of chicken food. <laughs> so anyways, we'll check this out tomorrow. Right, the next day, let's check it out. You set the camera on this little tripod. Yeah, those are my knees cracking. <laughs> so, let me see. Is there anything in there? Yeah, there's some crickets in there. Um, let me take this wood piece off. Can you guys see anything? So, let me get a better shot of this, better angle. Okay. Let's see. Oh yeah. There's some crickets in there. Sam? I'm not too sure how many's in there, but
But anyway, it works. Cricket trap. So I'm going to set it out here again tonight and see if I can catch more. Um, good food for my chickens. So anyway, subscribe. Up top over here. Post your comments down below. And um, check out our Facebook page. There's a link to it on my channel. Also a new blog. I have a blog on uh, my Facebook channel that you guys can go to that I put more information on usually um, on my projects. So, God bless.